what did I say in the moments when I thought we were done? Because I don't want that to... I just have to ask how you are. Well, <laughs> not exactly living my best life, yeah, but right. trying... Yeah. Um... When I was upset and I really thought we weren't going to speak again, you know, but... Um... You're part of the public conversation, you're public figures, and people feel like they have some sort of... And I really hope that it doesn't damage our relationship because I'm personally and you know it took a toll on my marriage and husband's name on jacket Kyle Richards stepped out wearing her estranged husband Mauricio Umansky's name on her jacket amid their separation the real housewives of Beverly Hills star raised questions about a potential reconciliation as she sported a long raincoat with Umansky written across the back while running errands in Los Angeles she completed her look with a black top and jeans paired with monogrammed hunter rain boots, a gray beanie, and sunglasses. Meanwhile, Umansky was nowhere in sight despite the Bravo Liberty proudly repping his name. While the current status of the pair's relationship is unclear, Richard's co-star Erica Jane hopes to get the real tea at the upcoming RHOBH Season 13 reunion taping. As somebody who got eviscerated, I would like to see everybody get the same treatment she told Andy Cohen on Watch What Happens Live last week. I love her. She's a dear friend of mine, Jane added of Richards, but fair is fair. Um, we laughed a lot. You sent so the I, proof to, the to your chat. family text <laughs> I, did, I did my vote, so I sent the screenshot. So you just came back in town from New York for Nikki's 40th. I did. I just have to ask how you are. Well, <laughs> not exactly living my best life, yeah, but right. trying... Yeah. Um, yeah, that was, I mean, yes, that hurt my feelings. <laughs> we, you know, we were very open this season. It's been a challenging couple of years. When I was upset and I really thought we weren't going to speak again, you know, but, um, you know, it is hard. It's got to be hard going through it also when people feel like, uh, because you're so... Um, what yeah. was your reaction to that? Uh, we're working through it and all good. Very good. What was your reaction to the recent pictures of Mo holding hands with his Dancing with the Stars partner? It was confirmed in July 2023 that the former couple was separating after 27 years of marriage. At the time, Richards, 55, and Umansky, 53, addressed allegations of infidelity amid rumors about her close friendship with Morgan Wade. There has been no wrongdoing on anyone's part, they said in a joint statement shared on social media. Although we are in the public eye, we ask to be able to work through our issues privately. While the couple has been candid about their split, the Dancing with the Stars alum told in October 2023 that he and the Halloween actress weren't throwing in the towel just yet. Umansky added that they are going to try to work through their marital woes and take it one step at a time. When we know what happens to us, you will know what happens to us, he added. Meanwhile, Richards has given a bit of insight into her struggles with Umansky throughout the current season of RHOBH. In an episode earlier this month, she vented to her co-stars about her frustrations with random women sliding into her ex's DMs. Mal gets a lot of DMs from women. They don't care that he's married and they're always the aggressor, she said, per people. The thing is, like, it's so hard with my family because I'm like, are they going to understand, you know? It's been really, it's been rough, you know, I'm not going to lie. I mean, we're married basically, I think we're married the same yeah. amount of years. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Um, somebody, I'm sorry, I don't know if anything's happened They're in yet. Beverly Hills, like, it's not like they're in some remote location. They're in the middle of Beverly Hills, you know that... You know, I, I would be remiss if I didn't ask, like, how are you? What did I say in the moments when I thought we were done? Because I don't want that to... Of course. ...who have been amazing, my, my four best friends, and um, it's just... I mean, hold, holding hands like that... I mean, Andy, I really don't, why are you doing this to me? Well, Dory, now that you're here, what can you tell us about all the rumors about you and PK? <laughs> you know, have an argument and make up like normal people. Or just be upset with each other for a day or two. Yeah. And they also want to create their own story because we haven't explained everything, which is, it's impossible to do. It just makes you realize there's a lot of effing a-holes out there, she continued. I've had a fight with Ma over that. I hate that. Liking people's photos, following people, you don't do that. Despite their differences, the duo has maintained an amicable relationship for their three daughters, Alexia, 27, Sophia, 23, and Portia, 16, most recently vacationing together for Christmas in Aspen, Colorado. Richards also shares daughter Farah Brittany, 35, with ex-husband Guaresh Aljufri, together for Christmas. 
Kyle Richards celebrated Christmas with her four daughters and estranged husband Mauricio Umansky. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star flew to Aspen, Colorado following her getaway vacation to Mexico to spend quality time with her family. Richards shared a series of photos in an Instagram reel early that showed her adult kids enjoying life as snow bunnies. Hoping you all had a Merry Christmas to my four daughters and you bring me happiness every day, Richards captioned her reel. Thank you for all the love and laughter and for loving each other the way you do. That's the best gift I could ever receive. The reality TV star and the agency co-founder have three daughters, Alexia, Sophia, and Portia, plus Richard's oldest, Farah, from her previous marriage to Garesh al -Jufri. In one blink and miss an image, Richard's can be seen posing on top of the mountain with her daughters as well as with Umansky. Richard's, 54, was photographed over the weekend dressed in head-to-toe ski garb as she readied herself to board the lift with Umansky who had spent his vacation hanging out with various influencers and musicians. But I don't want everything to have to be like, that's it, we're done. Right. Like, why can't we just... I was, um, I was taken aback, kicked everything up and ruined my relationship again. You know, true love doesn't exist, you know, you, you, you know, destroyed my dreams, I'm thinking... Yeah, we put out a joint statement immediately. It's almost as if, like, we haven't... But I also voted for them. Okay, you did. Yeah, I did. It was really, really nice. It was Good. really nice to hang out with Kathy. Fundamentally, I know that you and Maurizio are going through a lot, and, you know, I just... Do you think something's going on there? Um, I... He appeared to put his family hat on after partying it up with Brazilian singer Anita, DJ Pedro Sampaio, and more at the Cloud9 Alpine Bistro. The real estate mogul was also spotted departing for dinner with influencer and designer Alexandria Wolf, 31, However, a source close to Wolf confirmed that she and Umansky are just friends who share a special bond. Richards enjoyed a pre-holiday vacation of her own with Faye Resnick at the Lux Suceros del Corazon, which is part of the Auberge Resorts collection. Sometimes we just need to escape reality for a bit. Richards captioned a photo from her trip tagging the resort. The Bravo Liberty and interior designer 66 posed for bikini photos in the pool, and Resnick posted a picture of herself reading a book and sipping on a refreshing beverage. So needed this unexpected spa trip to paradise before Christmas with my girl, Resnick captioned her Instagram post. This property brings forth the true essence of Mexico, a feeling of an ancient escape surrounded by beauty, purity, and authenticity. And now we're okay again, and now I'm stressed that, you know, um, it's been difficult, you know, fortunately, in, you know, it is amicable and... Um, <laughs> well, I just don't think you hold hands like that. Send this to her, would you? Yeah. Kathy. <laughs> um, no, hmm. you know, I said these things and... Mentioned anything? Okay. Um, so the rumors are not true. Okay. We're not separated, we're not getting divorced. Okay. You're part of the public conversation, you're public figures, and people feel like they have some sort of... You know, when all these rumors I started... I that I did, too. I even sent the proof to <laughs> Partying it up. Mauricio Umansky took off his shirt and wildly sprayed champagne while partying in Aspen with singer Anita. The agency co-founder, who celebrated record-breaking sales with a dinner with his colleagues earlier, wasted no time continuing the festivities with the Brazilian singer, DJ Pedro Sampaio and more at Cloud9 Alpine Bistro. In photos and videos shared to Umansky's Instagram, the real estate broker can be seen bare-chested standing behind Anita, 30, who is wearing ski pants and a Moschino sports bra. The partying only escalated from there when the entire group began jumping and spraying wine everywhere. In a video obtained by TMZ, Mo fist-pumped while dancing on a bench with Anita and a friend. In another clip, the dad of four stood close to the singer as she twerked and ground her hips as she then turned to dance in front of him. Earlier this week, Umansky spent the day hitting the slopes with Anita and YouTube star Lily Pons, both of whom wore nothing but towels. Pons and Umansky met after they both participated in Dancing with the Stars, with Anita tagging along as the influencer's friend. They credited him on Instagram for being their filmer. He also said he had the perfect day and teased some of the women's shenanigans. Oh, I want to because... No, I'm glad. Yeah. Because it's so funny, I get asked that all the time that they don't see off camera. Well, it is weird, you know, because they they feel like 
So that scares me. I'm, I'm nervous about. Have you talked to Kathy about that? Listen, I love him very much and we are amicable, but that really did hurt me. And I really hope that it doesn't damage our relationship because I'm. Clip around. Uh. <laughs> Was Alison Dubois right? Because we're very, well. I'm so glad, I'm so glad. Well, no, I mean. While Umansky has been living it up in Aspen, his estranged wife, Kyle Richards, has been doing the same in Mexico, where she's been escaping reality. In photos obtained, the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star and pal Faye Resnick can be seen soaking up the sun in their bikinis. Richards showed Umansky what he is missing in a pink and orange cheeky bikini, which she paired with a yellow trucker hat and aviator sunglasses to protect her face from the UV rays. Resnick, 66, looked shredded in a nude chevron print string swimsuit, which she accessorized with a couple of hats, switching between a tan fedora and a straw cowboy hat. Sometimes we just need to escape reality for a bit. The actress captioned the photo of herself on the beach in an airy white dress. Not present on the vacation, it appears, is Richard's rumored flame, Morgan Wade. But then you also get the messages like, you know, um, all our hopes and dreams are crushed. Honestly, I mean, going through that and the stuff with Mo at the same time is really, really hard. You know, but it's, it's hard, you know. My main concern is um, our daughters, you know, issues with my family. And you know all the secrets of my family. Personally, and you know, it took a toll on my marriage and... Well, the thing is this, I don't know if anything's happened yet, but I, obviously there's something there and um, I'm so happy when we're in a good place. I mean... I, upset? I, I, upset? Yes, that was very hard to see. Who hasn't been seen with the Bravo celebrity since Kathy Hilton's Christmas party earlier this month. Hilton later described Wade, 29, and Richards as very good friends who partially bonded over their sobriety. That's all for this video, folks. See you next time.